We're nearly ready. Where's Peter? <laughs> oh, perhaps he's better out of the way today. Cottontail, arrange these mittens for me, will you? I suppose your cousin Benjamin hasn't called. No, no Mama. Mama. Breakfast time. <laughs> Lunch time. <laughs> Tea time. <laughs> Supper time. <laughs> Breakfast. <sighs> Where has Peter got to? I'm sure I said the lane. Oh, did we say the fir tree? I think I'm going to stand oh, here perhaps the... for that. I'm afraid you have made a mistake, Mrs. Postlewaite. Yeah. To think of all I've mm. done for her. Are oh. you listening to me? The ingratitude of it all. Mm. By the way, pray remind me to get a new pie dish. After all, I made all those scones for that last committee meeting, didn't I? Mr. McGregor. Well, what look? The McGregors are going out. I'd better find Peter. Though I don't really want to see Aunt Josephine. Anyway, I'd probably only spill things or break something. Goodness, Peter. What do you think? Who's got your clothes? The scarecrow in Mr. McGregor's garden. And if you're going to laugh, <coughs> Mr. McGregor nearly caught me. I was only looking around. Maybe I tasted a few things, but you should have seen him. No, no. That's what I came to tell you. Mr. McGregor has gone out in the gig. And Mrs. McGregor, and for the whole day. And I'm sure she was wearing her best hat. Well, I hope it rains. There, look. He's put them on the scarecrow. Hey, I love that tam o shanter. The gate's along here somewhere. It spoils people's clothes to squeeze under a gate. The proper way to get in is to climb down a pear tree. Goodness, be careful, Benjamin. Oh, come on, Peter, you can do it. Come on, you can do it. What do you think of this, then? I think my jacket shrunk. Uh, your shoes are full of water. Here, catch. Oh, Mama will be dreadfully angry. Oh, Aunt will never notice. We'll take her back a present. Some onions, perhaps. Uh, uh, come on, we can use the handkerchief to carry the onions. Aunt will be pleased with us. Oh, I don't think we need any more, Benjamin. Otherwise, I'll only drop them. Mmm, do taste some of these. Mm, you like this. What I would like is to go home. Oh, don't be such a worrier, Peter. Father and I are always coming here. We come and get lettuces for our Sunday dinner. We'll never get back up the pear tree with all these onions. We'll try the fire gate. Peter. Well, I'm doing my best. Why don't you help? Oh, no! Oh, bother! Look out, Benjamin! <gasps> Be more careful, Peter. Whatever's the matter? I just want to go home. Well, hurry up, then.
What should we do now? Quick! Under here! Do you think she saw us? What's she doing now? No. It's all right. She hasn't moved. Oh, my goodness. She's coming. Now what do we do? Keep quiet for a start. <laughs> There's no need to cry, Peter. I'm not. It's these beastly onions. I'll never look at another onion ever again. She'll have to go in for a supper soon. Please don't mention supper. That young rascal got to. M Mr. Bounce, sir. Have you seen my son, Peter? He's been missing all day. Benjamin has made himself scarce as well. Hmm. Just wondering whether I should go and look for him myself. Leave it to me, Josephine. I have a very good idea where they might be. And if I'm right. Oh, no. You don't think it's... Return to your little ones, Josephine. I shall deal with the young rascals, wherever they may be. first, I think. And let me assure you, this doesn't hurt me more than it hurts you. Mr. Bounce has gone to find... Here he is, Josephine. Peter! Unfortunately, none the worse. Oh, well, at least you've found your jacket and shoes, Peter. Mama! Though I shan't enquire where. I am obliged, Mr. Bouncer. Hmm? Oh, <laughs> not at all. My pleasure. Only young ones, what? <laughs> Happily, all has ended well. But let it be a lesson to you, Peter. <laughs> <laughs> 